Hi everyone, my name is Inosh and today I want to show you how to create repositories in Bitbucket. But you must be familiar how to create repositories using this GUI. So I want to show you something extra. Bitbucket has provided us with REST APIs. So if you go on this website developer.atlassian.com you can see some of the REST APIs that Bitbucket has provided us. So on the left hand side you can see the commit comments and similar things and on the right hand side you can see the get post put and delete REST APIs. So if I want to create something you can see here so create a new repository. So this is the curl command that they have provided us. So I can now create this repositories using a curl command. So if I execute this curl command on a command prompt, my repository will be created. However, if I want to create this using a Java code, I can do it that too. So dynamically I can have multiple repositories created according to my requirements. So I have created a Java code. Now this is a Spring Boot application that I have written and in this application I have uh, provided the URL that that was shown and uh, I'm passing my credentials and uh, this is HTTP URL connection that I have created. So I'll be using accepting and providing the JSON and I'm using a post request as I'm going to create a repository and here is the JSON object that I have created I have given the key and the name of the repository so when I executed this I got a JSON in a response so if I go home yeah this is the JSON I have received so I have formatted the JSON over here so you can see this JSON that they have provided. So this is uh, actually a metadata of the repository that was created. And uh, here you can see the curl command. Now you can use this curl command to create the repository from command prompt. So also there is one more uh, Java code that I have written. So this is what I found out. Uh, I found that uh, there is one more URL uh, in this you can provide the port number and the URL now if you are having uh, a huge team and they have provided you the URL and the port so you can uh, provide the URL and the port over here and rest all the things are the same and you can create the repository. So this is the only minor difference in the URL, but this is a crucial one. So if we go on my pet bucket account that I created recently, you can see that I have created test two as a repository over here. So in this way, I can create repositories. So similarly, you can explore this developers atlassian.com and you can create branches or other stuff